Delta. I'm a dental director from the Greater Los Angeles area. I'm a gifted design coordinator, and I'm for Joe Jen. So we have um, kind of an interactive session right now. How many of you, just raise your hands really quickly, are from industry? For Henry Shine, Colgate, from DTA. <laughs> and how many of you are oral health professionals? Go ahead. You all are the, this community is all about, and that's what we're celebrating today. So thank you to all of you who have participated and made Give Kids a Smile such a success. So yesterday at our first meeting in person in a long time, I got completely re-energized. A few things became obvious to me. One is that our committee is a group of all-stars. These all-stars have dedicated part, if not all, of their careers to helping vulnerable populations. The second thing was that these all-stars are not settling for the land. Tonight, I think we will see that we're together to celebrate. Well, um, so it takes not only all of you who are with us here who have come all across the country, but so many of your colleagues as well. So we'd love to show you a video to showcase um, Great Storm held the first Give a Kid to Smile event in St. Louis. The location efforts and outreach. After their initial visit, children begin to realize the value and importance of dental care. Give Kids a Smile is my passion. And now we'd like to bring up Dr. Craig Armstrong. So welcome, happy to have everybody here today. Um, I'm the chair of the ADA Foundation and I wanted to congratulate the Give Kids a Smile for 20 years of supporting dental professionals uh, to be able to deliver care to uh, uh, Give Kids a Smile has reached over 7, uh, 7 million children and the ADA Foundation has been a part of that. We're happy to have supported that over the years through um, Give Kids a Smile continuity grants uh, to nonprofits which help find these children in dental homes, which is very important. We can give the Give Kids a Smile events, but we need to follow up with them and make sure that these children have uh, dental homes. Also, the uh, ADA Foundation, while it's undergoing some changes right now, we're committed to supporting Give Kids a Smile. And we uh, are, over the last couple of years, have donated $1 million. And we look forward to 20 more years of working with Give Kids a Smile. And they, they know that's not true. <laughs> but um, Colgate is very proud to be a partner with Give Kids a Smile. This is my first year on the advisory board, and I'm very excited about it. Um, I've, I'm learning a lot from the hard work that's been done, and I'm learning that a lot of the I'm trying to put this thing, starting this thing 20 some odd years ago. So I get the huge, huge pleasure and honor to introduce a video we've just put together for this evening. Uh, <laughs> Played a vital role since to lead as the perfect example. American Dental Association, and I'm pleased to join you tonight in celebration of the 20th anniversary good oral health habits. That's seven million children and counting whose lives have been transformed. The smile of a child is simply contagious. It absolutely makes the world become more adaptable, impactful, and successful. 